Hey Cancer, welcome to my channel. This is a love romantic relationship reading for you, Cancer. This reading for today is for the um the third, sorry, the third week. This reading for today, Cancer, is for August 3 to August 9. This is a weekly reading session for Cancer friends. And as you can see, guys, I have already shuffled the card and pre-picked the card for you. As usual, I was talking for the last one, two minutes, and I have forgotten to press the the record button okay and just some house rules before i start i would like to acknowledge my subscribers thank you for coming back thank you for tuning in for guest viewers if you haven't clicked the subscribe button in the bell please do it now if you're interested and if you are keen and if you would like to further support me my channel um, follow me in Instagram. The details of my Instagram account is down in the description box below. Check out our website, www.sunshineco-essential.com. Check out our manifestation spray or mist. Um, there is one formulated for you, Cancer. Have a look at it. Even if you don't buy it, just read. Because um, I'm not sure whether you guys have some rit ritual... Um, if you're ritual ready, but just in case you are incorporating some sort of meditation or ritual, um, this is really helpful. It comes with a free digital astrology report valued for $17. It is free when you purchase the manifestation mist and it's free shipping worldwide. After we ship the product, we will send you a follow-up email on how to set up the manifestation and of course, an exclusive access to our meditation um, music or audio, okay? So it's not just selling, but it is also making sure that you utilize it, okay? So um, in today's reading, guys, I'm going to be looking at the um, the past, your energy, your person's energy, the mutual energy, the advice, predictive outcome advice in the immediate future. Depending on the message that I'll pick up, I'll let you know if I will extend the reading. So let's start it, okay? So the past situation for you, Cancer, is that you've got the Ten of Swords in reverse, the Seven of Swords in reverse, and the Emperor. A lot of petty quarrel. A lot of, um, a lot of, I'm hearing the word backdrop. There is definitely spite, pain, uh, betrayal in here. And, um, but there is a resiliency, okay? Because Ten of Swords, Seven of Swords. Um, you fight with this person, you argue with this person, you possibly break up with this person. Um, but you come out stronger. You and your person come out to be, um, the emperor for some of you i get that there is a person who's a bit manipulative um they want to be in control um you will have issue and then you will chase them and then they will act like a boss and they will be the one to decide when to get you back when to have you back or there's some sort of control freak <laughs> there is a controlling factor in your past energy for some of you those single cancer i really feel like um, this is you. You're getting mature and mature with your love romantic relationship situation. You know, you've been betrayed. You've been backstabbed. But you still believe that um, there's someone out there that from the past. You know, that there is someone out there for you. Configure for your needs. Okay. So, yeah. The past energy, it's really fluctuating on and off, on and off. There is success. There's win. There's also failure. Some For some of you guys, it's your fault. There is a full moon today, August 3 in Aquarius. Um, sign so that's probably why i sound like a bit futuristic or a bit overall it's too broad the the message i'm getting from the past energy it's too broad so yeah there is a failure there is a winning moment and what stands in here is the emperor card that um you are still there you're still connected things can evolve okay for as long as you are connected for as long as you bounce back or resilient you guys and this person could work things out for some of you, I feel like you are learning the lesson. You are becoming the right. You're be, you're becoming or having or developing the right lover's attitude and behavior because of the failure or the learning you've experienced from past people, past person, okay? Now, let's go to specific or more current energy for you, Cancer. You've got here Six of Swords. You're moving on. Okay, you're moving on. You are really into um, a connection, a relationship, or a communication that is very balanced. Okay, you're not using the emotional side of you. 
um, you're using a more balanced approach of things, of scenario. You're looking at, you're tapping at more on the sword element or the mind versus your heart. Because I felt like you trust your heart and your feeling, but sometimes you overuse that side of your um, yourself. If like you realize that you cannot depend or rely too much on the emotions or the heart side, you also have to listen to your brain to find balance between the right and the wrong, the right emotions versus um, the wrong emotions, when to stop and when to proceed. Okay, so I really feel like you've you've had this um, balance. Okay, you are realizing where you made a mistake and getting up and you know, making up and being accountable to that mistake. Six of Swords and the Justice card. You're moving to a more balanced and calm, okay? Calm manner situation. There's a possible breakup in here. You're moving on for some of you guys. Or you're moving on to something steady. To something that um, something that's balanced, okay? Your person's energy is two of cups, ten of wands. I think for some of you, you break up, you're separated, or if you're still in a relationship, this person is not really, um, not really into, because two of cups in reverse, they're not agreeing with you, they're not really very affectionate with you, they're very cold, they're very aloof, it's possible that you break up, ten of wands, they find it difficult to deal with you and your situation right now, and that's the reason why this person comes across aloof, they come across, um, distance cold um they're not really feeling the love because of the difficulty because of the struggle because of the overburden or burnt out energy you are more advanced in terms of the energy you're okay to move on you're okay to settle things up you're okay and open to talk your person is not yet done with the hardship or the negative energy there is still harboring pain and spite the mutual energy within the two of you is ten of cups, of course, as a result of you and them um, having or displaying unmatched love energy together. It's not yet perfect. It's not resolved. Things are not really as happy as it was in the past. There is a need for a structure. I honestly feel like you can save this, but your person is not paying attention with you because I felt like you're following up with them you are chasing them you are waiting for them but they're kind of the way this person thinks of you is that face the wall cancer okay like mm, i don't want to deal with you right now so give them give this time to your person ten of wands maybe they want to be alone maybe they want to unburden whatever it is it's a it's an image the image i see in here is that let them scream let them shake off that excess energy of hate or pain or disappointment that you you guys cause each other okay because you're ready they're not okay so simple as that and so the the vibe the rhythm between the two of you doesn't match it's not synchronized you're okay you're back to track this person is still behind okay in the immediate future um you've got the knight of cups this is good the eight of wands and the three of wands i get um i get an advice and a straightforward message for you cancer that um don't don't try to break up or don't give the message of closure if you don't meant it because three of wands because there's definitely love in the immediate future i see you in the coming in the coming days in the mid of august in next or next week or mid of august i honestly feel like um one of you will express their feelings with one another there's still love there's some sort of communication but after that things would slow down okay there is a slow progress okay the love energy it is a slow progress it's cooking it's like you're baking you have to wait for one hour for you to taste the food, then uh, for it to cook, and then wait another hour for for it to you know to, to taste to eat it to be edible because it's so hot if you eat it right after you take away you take it out from the oven. So you're being advised to be very patient. There's love. It's a slow progress, like a slow roast. <laughs> Isn't it nice if you eat? I don't know. Maybe I'm hungry, but a slow roast of love is here. So please avoid um, saying things like, I'm letting you go, goodbye, blah, blah, blah. If your person have not said that, don't 
initiate something of a breakup or a letting go if if you don't mean because it's definitely love and love is there's definitely love and feelings in here remember they have the ten of wands so this is this is not an easy energy to shake off so you know love will win love will come out they will miss you they will have some sort of message for you so stay be good be quiet don't say something you don't mean okay because they're planning to get back to you to connect with you and then you switch off you block them you turn them away so it's not nice you might regret this because i see in the immediate future a knight of cups a sincere offer and then you already switch in the mode of bye bye goodbye and you want your person to chase you so that's not nice so there's some sort of realignment that's gonna happen between the two of you i honestly feel like it's mid to end of august so right now um keep the door open okay don't hate too much don't don't think too much of that and this just live in the moment because i honestly feel like there's a knight of cups waving all right this is this is really good energy but it might be interrupted because i don't know what you'll say but i fear there's a caution attached with the three of wands they've got a plan by the time they've got a they have a plan by the time they're ready you are not you said goodbye or you push the button because you're so impatient or you lost you know you lost um you you were kind of temperamental oh i'm done waiting something like that so give this person and your situation some sort of space and um yeah don't trigger something you don't mean don't say something you mo you don't mean because you might regret it there's a knight of cups okay i'm saying the same message anyhow thank you my friends for being here thanks for tuning in i hope to see you soon again you have a great week bye bye <laughs>